fear of the Bearcats Sports Network. Ball is up, and the Bearcats will start on the attack. And for Sam Houston, they will line it up this way with Flag, Lampley, May, Ikpe, and Ray. That's a pretty standard starting lineup for head coach Jason Hooten. Meanwhile, for the Tarleton Texans, three ball from DeMarcus Lampley to get things started. They will have McDavid, Hicks, Bogues, Small, and Gibson on the floor for them. So the Bearcats draw first blood with a three from DeMarcus Lampley. And I wonder what that's going to do for their confidence, Ken, to see that first shot go in after shooting just 25% on Saturday in the loss to Grand Canyon. Well, Coach Hooten mentioned it before the game. They needed to get shots, and they, that's what they did on that first one, a three-pointer by DeMarcus Lampley. This is McDavid dished it off to our player, Travis Small, or Taj Small. His three-pointer rimmed in and out. And the Bearcats come back the other way. To the basket was May, but he got the, the rim. Got part of that, put it back down. Got a little bit too far underneath the basket to try and get a step around the big man for the layup. Small in the corner for McDaniel. And his shot is no good, and Flag will take down the rebound. Jaden Ray. His entry pass tipped and deflected, taken away by Shamir Bogues. That's the second deflection for Charlton tonight so far. Good ball movement by the Texans, but they couldn't get a shot away despite it all. Here's Small trying to attack. He's got a mismatch with Ray on him. They dish it off, three-pointer left side, no good. Long rebound, however, comes down to Bogues. Bogues gets it back. He'll put up a lefty three that is good. Shamir Bogues, sophomore from Colleen with the first points for the Texans who are even up at three apiece. You know, great job by the Texans to continue to move the ball around until they find the open man in Bogues. Three ball is no good by Jaden Ray. It's a one and done. So after making their first shot, Bearcats have missed two. Ball for Bogues. Ball off his fingertips, out of bounds into the Sam Houston bench. The head coach Jason Hooten there. Early substitution is Javon Grant will come in. Jaden Ray will take a quick seat. Grant, freshman out of Pittsburgh, Kansas. Has really seen his Playing time increased here over the last month. Savion Flag trying to work on Small. The 17-footer rims in and out, no good. Good block out by the Texans. And the rebound taken down by Freddie Hicks. Three minutes gone by. 3-3 is our score. Both teams 1-4 from the field. Ball guarded by Javion May now. Gets it back. He'll shoot the three this time. Too strong. Long rebound. Tipped up in the air. Slapped out. But goes into the arms of the Texans in the block down low by Ikpe. Lampley lost control of the ball. Goes out of bounds. Unforced error. Great job by Tristan Ikpe to get all ball with that block. And to rotate. That was not his man. He went over there and protected the goal. Absolutely. This is Shamir Bogues for Hicks. Now in the corner for Small. On the wing is Gibson. In the corner, Bogues. Three ball will come from Bogues. Rims in and out, no good. Ikpe with the rebound. The quick dish to Grant. Back come the Bearcats. Grant through traffic with a little floater in the lane. So it'll be Tarleton to inbound underneath their defensive basket. They get it in with no problem to Hicks. Now Bogues will take it down the floor and the shot clock didn't go properly. I don't know if the 
shot clock didn't start on time. The game clock didn't start on time. We're going to leave it at 29. All right, we got down to 27. I'll believe that. There's a shot clock. Yeah. So the Texans with Bogues trying to run the play out top. Bogues sophomore from Colleen has their only basket. Here is Hicks. Back to Bogues. To Hicks in the lane. The floating right-hander is no good. And Javion May takes down the rebound. It's not a surprise that Javion May gets rebounds. No. Put it off the right-hand block for Ikpe. Ikpe, bounce pass for May through the lane, too strong. Didn't catch the glass. Had he caught the glass, that might have had a chance, but he missed the glass until it was past the basket. Five minutes gone by. Here is Small. Dishes off for Bogues. Now Gibson. And Gibson had a heel on the sideline. Turnover. Second one of the ball game for Tarleton. Dante Powers will check in. J.B. May will sit down for the Bearcats. Starting five, just been replaced. First substitution in the ball game for Tarleton, and that is Shakur Daniel, number 13. Billy Gillespie doesn't go very deep on his bench. If he goes by seven, he's yeah. gone a lot. Here's Grant, nice turn away on the attempted steal. In the corner, Lampley for three. It's short. Rebound comes down. It's taken away by Gibson. Gibson will try and rush up the floor to Small. Small cut off on the baseline by Powers. The turnaround right-hander is no good. And the rebound taken down by Ikpe. Grant, backdoor pass for Ikpe with a finish with the left hand. Wow, what a pass from Grant to Ikpe. And nice finish off the glass. 7-3, Bearcats on top, just over six minutes gone by. Here is Daniel for Bogues through the lane with a left-hander, leaves it short, rebound batted around. Who's going to come up with it? Bogue on the floor, rolled it out to a teammate, and it finally gets a small for the basket. What heads-up play by Shamir Bogues to get the deflection on the ground and pass it. Does he get an assist? He doesn't. In oh, hockey, yeah. he would. There you if, go. This, if this were hockey, there are two assists that can be given on a goal. Laid it down low again in the finish for Ikpe. And again, Grant and Ikpe hook up for easy baskets for the Bearcats. 9-5 our score. Shakur Daniel. Off on the wing for Small. Trying to get around Powers. The floater in the lane is no good. Rebound cleared by Flag. Flag will take it down the left sideline himself. Gave it to Ikpe. Ikpe looking for room. Going to be a travel. Might have been the easier call because the easier could have been called for a push off there as well. Substitution for the Bearcats. The grant transfer from Utah State, Kuba Karwaski by way of Warsaw, Poland. Well, speaking of Warsaw, Poland and international student athletes, the Johnson Coliseum staff and the Bearcat Athletics, they decided to have a moment of silence for what's going on with the Ukraine and recognizing that the international student athletes and students that are here. And Poland being one of the places where Ukrainian refugees are trying to relocate to. The block by Flag on the shot attempt by McDavid. Flag down the baseline, can't get it to go, but he'll draw the foul on Noah McDavid. And uh, speaking of the international athletes, it hits close to home here in Sam Houston because one of the members of the bowling team is from the Ukraine and her family is still back there uh, hiding out in a bunker somewhere trying to stay safe. And so we wish her and her family all the best. We wish all the people over there the safest possible days ahead that they can have. Yeah, Save. and she's here tonight. You see the block by Savion Flag. Challenge and shot by McDavid. McDavid tried to race him back down the floor defensively and drew the foul. And Flag will go two for two for the free throw line for his first two points in the ball game. Seven and a half going by, 11 to five. Bearcats with a six point lead, their largest in the ball game. Javante Hopkins, 14, has checked in. That's their second substitution for Billy Gillespie. Hopkins dishes off on the wing for McDavid. 
Back out to Hopkins. Now Montre Gibson. Trying to go cross court for McDavid. Seven to shoot for Tarleton. Deflected pass taken by Flag. Ahead he goes. Grant behind the back for Flag for the slam. Hopkins will try to complete a three point play here. And the free throw off the back iron, no good. So it stays at 13 to 5. But the way that finished was a little bit reminiscent of how the Bearcats left the floor before the ball game started. They ran a pseudo football play from midcourt where a man in motion came from the wide receiver left, took a toss, threw a pass downfield to a receiver who then lateral to Savion Flagg, who finished the play with a monster dunk just like that. Yeah, it's, it's too bad we didn't have the cameras yeah, on that play that so one. we could see that. That was awesome. Bearcats are coming out with a lot of energy tonight. The nice thing about that play, you know, Savion got the steal. And was willing to give it up because he, he saw gave, Grant yeah. was ahead. Yeah, and then Grant gave it right back to him. Inbounds it comes for Flagg. Flag will pull up, 15-foot jumper, runs in and out, no good. And Hopkins will take down the rebound for the Texans. This is Montre Gibson on the baseline for Small. Good pump fake underneath and got it around. Flag. Taj Small with his second basket. Makes yep. it a 13-7 game. Great drive to the basket by Small. Again, we talked about him earlier needing to get out early in this ball game. Grant double teamed out top, goes for Ray who is checked back in. Now Karwowski off the block, back out to Ray. Ray for Grant, five to shoot for the Bearcats. Ray will try and penetrate for Karwowski, back outside. Karwowski had to go, he, didn't, he wasn't aware of the shot clock, but he couldn't do anything with it there because he was too far underneath the basket to do anything, so he had to pass out. Yeah, that, and he was off balance to try to get that from going out of bounds. Grant will check out. Grant with productive minutes off the bench, seven minutes and three assists, and a bucket. That was the fourth turnover for the Bearcats. Small's got it in the left corner. Outside he comes for Gibson. Eventually goes back to Small. Gibson out top for McDavid. The jumper from the wing by Cooper is no good, but another chance. Nope. Ball comes into the arms of Flag, and the Bearcats will take it away. Speaking of Flag, I think he got his hand on that, that shot, deflected it. Flag with already five rebounds in the ball game. He'll try a three. That's too strong. And the rebound on the backside for Hopkins. Javante Hopkins, the six-foot junior from Houston, Fort Ben Travis High School. Here's Gibson. Drops it off back. Daniel's shot is good from the left elbow. Shakur Daniel, his first basket of the ball game, cuts the lead down to four, 13 to nine. Bearcats haven't scored in two and a half minutes now. Here's Karwowski out top. Flag, three, left corner. Back iron, no good. Rebound again, taken down by Hopkins. Seems like if Flag misses, Hopkins got the rebound no matter where it is. Three on the night for Hopkins. Oh, I missed shots by Flag. Nice shot by Hopkins over the long, outstretched arm of Karwowski. Back-to-back -back buckets. Well, that's Hopkins' first, rather. Inbound. Dante Powers in the ball game now. He got it in for Ray, and now May. And we get jockeying for position. Ikpe bottled up. Going to be against Hopkins. Ikpe is going to win that battle all the time. Ikpe at 6'6", six, six, and Hopkins at 6 foot. New 20 to shoot for the Bearcats. Fumbled by Lampley, but recovered. Lampley shoots it out top for Powers. Powers for Lampley, right wing three. Back iron no good, long rebound for Ray. It's good on the floater from the free throw line. Jaden Ray's first basket of the contest. Ends the drought. 
at nearly three and a half minutes long for the Bearcats. 8.20 left here in the first half in a four-point game. Shakura Daniel. Four to shoot, lost the ball. Lampley ahead of the field. McDavid going to try and cut him off, but Lampley uses the basket as protection to lay it in. Great yeah. move by the senior. That was a great steal by the senior as well. Defense creating offense for the Bearcats. 7.40 to play first half. Small almost lost the dribble. Gives it up to Hopkins. He will go for Daniel. Daniel's got it back, five to shoot again. Hopkins slips and falls. From Odessa, Ukraine, Sofia Droichna. We mentioned that her family is still back there and trying to stay as safe as possible. And we wish them all the best and a, hopefully a quick end to this unrest. Three-pointer by Javion May was no good. Tarleton comes back the other way. Hopkins deflected it basically to McDavid. Now they find Gibson. Back to McDavid, good pump fake. Step in, 18-footer is too strong. Trying to go over the back is small. Is he going to get the foul? I think he is. It is going to be on Taj Small, his first foul. That's five now against the Texans. Sam Houston is yet to commit a foul here in the first half. Probably shouldn't have said that because <laughs> you know it usually happens. Yep. The Tom Franklin jinx. No, it's just not my jinx. Oh, it, no. it, it's the announcer jinx. Oh, no. Here's May trying to get in the lane. A little runner is good this time. Javion May just muscling his way through traffic and got the little looper. 19 to 11, back to an eight-point lead for the Bearcats, equaling their biggest here in the first half. Bearcats have scored six in a row over the last two minutes. Here is Small, and this time, see, there it is. First defensive time after I say it, May gets the whistle, and it's the first foul on the Bearcats. At least I'm predictable, Ken. Yep, <laughs> if anything. <laughs> New 20 to shoot for the Texans as we approach the six minute mark here in the first half. Gibson for Hopkins, now back to Small. Gibson throws it out top. Hopkins will take it from 18 Ooh. feet and knock it home. Javante Hopkins, his second basket. That was a tough shot. Well, especially with the clock winding down, he had to take that tough shot. Got to be impressed with Sam Houston's defense so far in the first half. They are just in your face and giving Tarleton the taste of their own medicine because, oh, reverse layup, no Ooh. good by Powers, but the putback is good by May. That's the second offensive rebound by the Bearcats with points with it. Coach Hooten talked about how important it was going to be to get those offensive boards in this game. Billy Gillespie's teams have long been noted for their defense, and the Bearcats going right back at them. There's a three ball from the right wing by Noah McDavid to end the scoring drought for the Texans, making it a 21-16 game. Now we got five minutes to play here in the first half. Pick and roll for Ikpe. Ikpe with the left hand off the glass. In and out, no good. Rebound fought for. May has got his hands on it. He gets tied up by Small. We'll have a jump ball and alternating possession. We'll send it back to the Texans. So Savion Flag will come in for Dante Powers. And Javon Grant's going to come in, and he will come in for Jaden Ray. Looked like it was going to be a nice shot by Ikpe, but yeah. just a little high off the glass. and. Just got a little out. bit too much rim. Inbounds for Small, almost a steal by May. He knew what was coming. He just ran out of court. He got his hands on the ball. Would have been a good turnover, except he was right on the baseline. He couldn't stop his momentum from going out of bounds. And yeah, those cameramen down there get some good shots with the action right in front of them. The inbound to Small again this time. This time, May was not 
going to anticipate. They back off the defense as the Texans come into front court. Small pump fake got May in the air. Way off the mark with that shot. The ball goes right in the lap of Savion Flag. Flag will give it to May. Now Grant out high around Ickpay's screen. Pick and roll for Ickpay. It goes and one. Grant and Ickpay have really got it working tonight. That's the third time they have hooked up. Foul is on Taj Small, his second. Ickpay with three buckets, all on great passes from Javon Grant. And Grant already has four assists on the ball game so far. Bearcats have five total. So now Ickpay with a chance to complete the three-point play. And does. Grant averages 1.3 on the season, so this four so far early in this ball game. Going to boost that average. And again, the Bearcats have an eight-point lead at 24 to 16 with 4.15 left here in the first half. Montre Gibson, their leading scorer, has been held scoreless so far. Gibson's got it on the perimeter, goes cross court for McDavid, shot clock at eight. They get it inside for Hicks, ball knocked away out of much tougher. They have scored 18 of their 24 points in the paint. Inbounds it comes, it comes out. Hopkins will have to shoot it at the buzzer off the iron, no good. The rebound comes down to Ikpe. Ikpe had the ball deflected. Montre Gibson was in there, almost thought he could snatch one and got his fingers on it, but couldn't keep control. Went out of bounds. He'll stay with Sam Houston. Well, you mentioned something about the Bearcats being tougher. That's exactly what Coach Hooten said earlier about they needed to play tougher than the Texans tonight. So far, that's what they're doing. Grant out high, pulls up at the elbow, shoots it across the floor for Lampley. Lampley through the lane, back outside for Flag. Flag on the run. He tried to pass it out. Ball was deflected and taken away by Gibson. Turnover number five for the Bearcats. Five for each team now with 3.15 to go in the first half. Here's Freddie Hicks. Back outside for Hopkins. That's Daniel back to Hopkins in the lane off the glass. No good. Tipped his own rebound in. Wow. Nice drive to the lane. The and a six-footer gets the tip. Yep. With a lot of traffic around him. Six points off the bench for Javante Hopkins. 24-18 with 2.25 to play. Try the entry pass to Ikpe, kicked by Hopkins. They'll reset the shot clock to 20. And Jaden Ray will come back in, and Javon Grant will check out with his two points and four assists now. Ray gets the impound, flips it back to May. So are these two guys, Ray May or May Ray? <laughs> Here is Ray to the basket, left-hander no good. Ikpe gets in for the rebound and a second chance for the Bearcats. Flags, three-pointer on the dish is good. Well, another offensive rebound leading to points. Savion Flag with seven now to tie Ikpe for the scoring leadership for the Bearcats, who lead by nine. And that's their biggest margin of the ball game so far. Here's Hopkins. For Hicks now on the left wing. Hicks goes on the right side. McDavid's three is nothing but net. Second three of the ball game for Noah McDavid. Cuts the deficit back to six for the Texans. We're under two minutes to go now. Ray out at the logo at midcourt. Gives it up to Ikpe. Ikpe will try and drive against Hicks. The lefty is good. Tristan Ikpe with nine points in the first half to lead all scores. Tristan Ikpe is playing with great energy tonight. And determination. Yes. Here is Gibson, the dish off for Hicks. His three is good. Back-to-back -back threes for the Texans. First McDavid and now Hicks. Well, great back-to-back -back possessions where the Texans move the ball around to the open man, get those three-point shots. They're now 4-12 from beyond the arc. Here's Ray, cross-court for May and back outside for Flag. Minute to go now here in the first half. 
Flag around the screen, going to be an offensive foul on Ikpe. Ikpe gets the whistle, just the second foul against Or do they call it on Ikpe? Yeah, they call it on Ikpe. I, I thought for a minute they were going to call it on, on Flag, and I knew it wasn't on him. It had to be Ikpe setting the moving screen. So 55 seconds to go. Texans with the ball, trailing by five. As close as they've been in quite some time. Gibson off on the wing for Hicks. Gets the return. McDavid almost had his shot. He was going to have a shot blocked by Lampley and dished it off instead. Here's Hopkins from the right elbow. It's short. Rebound to Ikpe. Ikpe will give it to Ray. And uh, the Bearcats can milk it for the final shot if they want. There's just tenths of a second difference between shot clock and game clock. McDavid all up in the face of Ray. Ten to shoot now. Now with five. Ray attacks, pulls up, left elbow jumper is short, rebound. Has an opportunity to build a program into a D1 level. Flag deflected the inbounds pass. The return to flag finish. Just 15 seconds gone by, and the Bearcats have stretched the lead back out to eight. Here's McDavid who drew that foul, gives it to Bogues. Now for Taj Small. 28 in the first meeting, held to just four points in the first half. Here is Gibson. Shot clock down to five. Gibson attacks, shoots it off on the wing. Small for three, no good. Rebound tipped by Flag, controlled by Hicks, thrown back out, tipped. And who's going to get it? It's going to finally get a go to Javion May for the Bearcats. On the wing is Lampley. Fake the three, got cut off, back outside it comes. Flag will take the three, and nothing but net. Savion Flag. He says, you take the two away from me at the end of the half, I'll just come back with three. Thank That's you very right. much, and getting double figures with ten. Great start by the Bearcats. Good ball movement on that last possession. Biggest lead in the ball game, and it doesn't for Sam Houston. Just a minute and 20 into the second half. This is Freddie Hicks. Cannot get her away from Ikpe. Leaves for Gibson. Pull up 10 footer is good. Montre Gibson, their leading scorer at 15.1 on the year, gets on the board, but it took him 21 and a half minutes to get his first points. Jaden Ray really getting after it with Shamir Bogues. And here's Ikpe back to Ray. Dishes in the wing. May didn't take the three. Comes back outside for Lampley. Lampley to the baseline for Ikpe. And now May is open for three straight away. No good. Rebound taken down on the backside by Gibson. Kept it in bounds and got it ahead to Hicks. And now Small. One thing the Bearcats have done is they have recovered on defense because Tarleton does not have any fast break points so far in the game. That's, that's an incredible stat. Three ball from the right corner is no good by McDavid. Rebound to May. Quick outlet pass for Flag. The Bearcats come back the other way. May a Flag for three. Off the back iron, no good. May fought for the rebound. Got it loose, but it went into the arms of Hicks. Here's Small, jab step and contact, and May is going to pick up his third foul. He doesn't agree with that call. But he is the lone player in any kind of foul trouble that is going to bring Dante Powers up off the bench. Billy Gillespie is telling that official that it should be his fourth foul. <laughs> Total fouls in the game. We have only had 11 calls. Underneath, Freddie Hicks wide open for a little easy basket. His second one of the ball game gives him five points. And it's 35 to 28. So the lead has been trimmed back to seven. A lot of contact between Ray and Bogues. They feed on the block to Ikpe, back out to Ray. His three is short. 
Rebound, Ikpe got in for it, had his pocket picked, however, by Gibson on the backside. Alert play by Gibson, who dishes off on the wing. Picks going to the baseline, and Powers is going to pick up the foul. Too much body there as he tried to get to the baseline and do attack. Three and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. Now it's going to be Javon Grant. He will come in for Jaden Ray. Grant with a very productive first half. Played nine minutes, had four assists and two points. Baseline shot by Gibson is good. That's his second bucket of the half. Montre Gibson, the senior from DeSoto via Ranger College. Who's Grant going to assist it to this possession, Tom? <laughs> he oh. tried to go back door for Ikpe. That's been the combination. Three of his four assists have been setting up Ikpe. That time the pass a little bit too strong, a little behind. So as we hit the 16-minute mark, Tartan with a chance to trim this lead a little bit closer. Five is as close as they have been in a long time. They got it down to within five right at the end of the half. It was 29 to 24. They pulled back to within five here after a quick start by the Bearcats. And Montre Gibson has got three straight buckets for the Texans. And has made this a three-point game with 15.40 to play. Bearcats haven't scored in 316. Here's Powers. He ends that drought right there with a three ball from the left corner. His first basket of the game, much needed by the Bearcats to stretch the lead back out to six at 38 to 32. Well, he heard you that they hadn't scored in a while, <laughs> I so guess. he took care of that. Here's Gibson. Turning on the baseline, pump fake, laid it off, and finish for Shamir Bogues. His second bat in the ball game. He's got five, and it's 38-34. Well, whatever Billy Gillespie said to his team and the halftime timeout has worked because this is a different Tarleton team that we saw in the first half. Flag, double team, shoots it off in the corner. Three is on the way and good for Lampley. Great job by Savion Flag to get out of that double team. He just wrapped that ball up and went, got through it, dished it off for that three-point shot. The strength of flag on that to find the wide open man since he was double teamed. Here's Gibson again. He's been the hot hand right now. Ten to shoot for the Texans. Gibson shut off. This is back outside. Three from Hicks is good. We've got ourselves a four point game. 41 37. Sam Houston on top. But Tarleton has come on. Out here in the second half on fire, hitting six of eight from the field to close the gap down to four. It was as big as 11 for the Bearcats at 35 to 24. But it's a 13 to six run since then. Here's Lampley for three. Couldn't get it to go, but ikpay has got the rebound knocked out of his hand, stays with on the baseline. They get it in for Lampley in the corner. He'll take it out top for Powers, but in the first half, Sam Houston was clearly the team that had the extra step. But here in the second half, Ken, it looks as though Tarleton has got the extra step so far in these first seven minutes. Get a foul down on the block against Tarleton. It's against Taj Small, his third. Second team foul. Well, the one thing that Tarleton's doing, they're playing a lot more physical. They're a physical play, playing team anyways, but they're going to have to amp it up. But that means more fouls can come. Step back jumper from the top of the arc is no good by Ray. A rebound pulled down by Ikpe. The finish will go. Tristan Ikpe in double figures with 11 for the Bearcats. That's that determination that you mentioned earlier about Tristan Ikpe. And not only do you have to have the energy, but you've got to have that, that look in your eye. Right. And Ikpe has got 11 points and seven rebounds to go with it. Approaching 13 minutes to play here in the ball game. This is Shamir Bogues. Three to shoot, two to shoot. Just before the clock, Small nails the three from the left side. His first three of the game, he's got seven. And the lead has been trimmed to three. And Tarleton has hit six of their last six field goal attempts. That's why they are within three. Lampley had the ball tipped out of his hands by Gibson. 
And an offensive foul, push off on Savion Flagg. His first, Bearcats third here in the second half. You know, Tom, I don't know if we'll get a chance to look at that, but there was contact. I think the Texan player was falling back. Then he had his arm pushed out. If he would have just left his arm alone, it may not have been called. So here comes Tarleton with a chance to maybe tie, but Tristan Ikpe with a steal on the bounce pass into the lane. Raise three is no good. Flag flies in for the rebound and the finish. Wow. What an offensive er, rebound from Savion Flag. Flag has a dozen. 45-40. Back out to a five-point lead for the Bearcats. Approaching 12 minutes to play. We have got a dandy tonight here in Johnson Coliseum in Huntsville. Bogues for Small. Hicks on the block. Ball poked out of his hands from behind by Flag. Into the arms of Powers. Powers goes behind his back to Flag. Bad pass. Flag was not expecting it. Taken away there by Hicks to the basket. Hicks a 77% free throw shooter. Makes it look easy. He's got 11. Two point game now. And the tide has turned. There's Jaden Ray up the right sideline. All the way across court to May for three. Bullseye. Javion May with a three ball for the Bearcats. And it's 48 to 43. May just hanging out in the corner. He was the only one on that side of the floor yeah. for either team. Yeah, everybody collapsed to the ball. There was nobody within 20 feet of him. Out top is Shakur Daniel. Taj Small. Montre Gibson for three. Back iron no good. Flag had the rebound knocked out of his hands from behind by Shamir Bogues. He'll go over to the Bearcats with one tick more than 11 minutes to play. A little bit of pressure for Tarleton. But they back off. May gives to Ray. <laughs> Jaden Ray trying to get a step to the basket and laid it in with the right hand. He's a lefty, but used the right hand for the finish. Second basket for Jaden Ray, and it's 50 to 43. Uh, he turned the Jets on to drive to the lane. Gibson for Bogues. Bogues down in the corner for Daniel. He's back out top with 10 to shoot for Gibson. Bogues around the arc with three to shoot. Gibson with two, with one. Hicks got it away in time. It's no good and flag skies for the rebound. How many times have we seen Tarleton get a shot off within the final three seconds of the clock, Ken? A bunch. Shows you how good and how tenacious the Sam Houston defense has been tonight. Under 10 to go, and we get a foul fighting for position. It's going to be uh, Shakur Daniel. He was bodying for position with Tristan Ikpe. Yeah, a little bit of mismatch there, so he's fighting for that position. They lob it in for Flag. Flag clear to the basket for the jam. Wow. They yep. went for the steal, and when his defender went roving by, nobody else was paying attention. 14 for Savion Flag. 52 43. Bearcats have suddenly taken a two point game and built it back out to nine. Bearcats on a 7 0 run over the last minute and 45. Steal. Loose ball on the floor, and we get a tie-up. And Jaden May is not happy with that call. Yeah, I don't blame him. The Texan player was over his back. He was sitting, and he was coming from over the top. Yeah. Let's take a look at Savion Flag here on the inbounds. See, everybody turned the other way on the pass went out high on the inbounds. <laughs> and Flag said, thank you very much. Lampley will check out. Powers comes back in. Seven to shoot, six to shoot. I wonder if Tarleton knows that the shot clock did not reset. Hicks' shot at the buzzer is no good. Rebound cleared out by the smallest Bearcat on the floor, Jaden Ray, and he was looking for a contact foul on the rebound. I don't think this game's gonna get any less physical here on out, Tom. Uh, no. 
Nine minutes to play. Jaden Ray for Dante Powers. Open for three up top. Off the iron, no good. The rebound to Freddie Hicks. He'll give it up to Gibson, and Gibson will take it back the other way for the Texans. Gibson off in the corner. Three ball, McDavid is short. Flag clears the rebound. Outlet pass for May. May will take it across the line. Leave it for Flag. In the corner, too strong and too tall for Jaden Ray. He was wide open, but the ball was just meant for a taller player, and uh, that was... Had a lot of gas That on was it. the fastball. That yeah. was for sure. Had a lot of gas that on That had it. a lot on that thing. After that last rebound, Savion Flag has nine searching for that. Another double-double. Double, double. Eight minutes, 20 seconds to go. Gibson out on the right side. Back for Daniel to Gibson. Gibson off on the wing, gets it back. Four to shoot. Shot at the buzzer is good by Noah McDavid. He's got nine points on three threes in the ball game. 52-46, the six-point lead for the Bearcats. Under eight to play now in Huntsville. Jaden Ray out top for Javion May. May will take it to the right sideline with eight to shoot for Flag. The floater in the lane is short. May have rushed that shot a little bit. The rebound comes down to Daniel. Daniel leads for Gibson. Back to Daniel. Daniel with a foot. Record also coach for, for Coach Lon Raisman as an assistant from 93 to 04. And he has two degrees from Tarleton. But he got a rude welcome back home back in January he when did. Tarleton scored the victory in this series. And that's the first time he's competed against the Texans as a head coach. Here's Savion Flag. Around the screen, back outside. Powers, pump fake, steps into the elbow for the jumper, it's good. Dante Powers, his first basket of the night, makes it 54 to 46. Texans won that first matchup 75 to 64, almost two months ago on January the 6th. JV on May was out of that game. To the basket is Hicks, and he'll get the roll. Freddie Hicks with 13 points, 10 of those here in the second half. He's been responsible for keeping the Texans close since 54-48. Javion May makes a big difference when he is right. on the floor for the Bearcats. He just brings so much. He brings physicality and toughness, determination, and it rubs off on his teammates. Ikpe turned his way into a double team in the lane. It's a tie-up, but it'll stay with the Bearcats. Ten to shoot. Well, the Texans in that first game let the three-pointers rain that night, and if JV on May would have been in that game, he's going to guard the out to the shot a lot better. Not saying that the Texans wouldn't have won that game, but right. that was a big difference. They get it in for flag. Too strong off the glass. Rebound tip back out. They see it didn't touch the rim. Four to shoot. Powers has got to pull up and shoot at the buzzer, and he got it. Back-to-back wow. -back big shots for Dante Powers. Good awareness by Dante Powers. Just take a look at that shot clock. I think he had a few voices in his ear. Probably Coach Hootens was the loudest. Yeah. 56-48, 5.50 to play. Here is Gibson. He's had a good second half. Gibson back outside for Small. Small through the lane, up off the glass. It didn't go, came out. Rebound tipped around, patted around, picked up by Flag. He'll try and take it coast to coast. Had his pocket picked by Gibson. Gibson hounded in backcourt, got the ball ahead. This is Hicks at the free throw line. Oh. And had his pocket picked by Ray. He was so busy trying to work from position against Ikpe. Ray came in and said, I'll take this, thank you. Boy, Ray came all the way back across the court and just snuck in behind him, stole that out of his pocket. Timeout called by Jason Hooten and the Bearcats with 5.14 to play. We'll keep it right here. 14 points for Savion Flag, 11 for Tristan Ikpe, 10 for Javion May. And Tom, we mentioned it earlier, Savion Flag has another double-double on the season. And for Tarleton, they are led by Freddie Hicks, who's 13. He's the only player in double figures for them. But they've spread it out. Nine points for McDavid, 
seven for Small, six apiece for Gibson and Hopkins, five for Bogues. Everybody gets involved who sees it. You know, he's only gone seven deep, but they're all on the score sheet. They all have more than just one basket. You know, they all make a contribution for Billy Gillespie. But I think, Tom, though, when you're only playing seven in a physical game like this, you got to worry about fatigue at this point, right? You would think. But when you're used to playing seven all the time, That's these true. guys get big minutes all the time. So the inbounds comes to Jaden Ray. Ray on the right sideline for Powers. They lob it back door for flag. Pump fake. Couldn't get it to go, but he got fouled. It'll either be Hicks or Small. It's going to be Small. Taj Small with his fourth. Well, Tom, what this does for the Bearcats, they could expend a lot of energy tonight because this is it. Yep. Right? They don't have a game on Saturday. They're going to get a lot of rest. Uh, they they may, be, they, they'll be the freshest team in Las Vegas. Absolutely. Absolutely. And some of these teams that are having to play makeup games, they have multiple games this week, more so than they would regularly with COVID issues. Flag's free throw is good. Give him 15 to lead all scores. Flag from the line. Three out of four. Javon Grant will come in. And Javion May will take a breather. 5.02 left. Flag. Cannot extend the lead to double figures. He misses the second. Here we go under the five minute mark, 57 to 48. Here is Small, ball controlled. He almost had it knocked away, but he kept possession and got all the way to the hoop. Nine for Ty Small. Great, great focus on Small to keep that ball in his hands. Grant will give it up to Ray. Playing basically with two point guards, but Ray will be the main point guard, and the auxiliary will be Grant. Ten to shoot for the Bearcats as Ray tried to give and go. They tried to lob it back for a flag. It was tipped away, and here come Tarleton. They trail by seven with 4.15 to go, trying to shrink that deficit again. Here is Small at the elbow. Step back. Jumper in and out, no good. Rebound to Lampley. Pretty good look by Small, couldn't get it to finish. Under four to play now. Next stoppage will be the final official's timeout. Here's Powers. They get it quickly in the corner for Grant, and back out to Ray with 10 to shoot. Ray will try and drive. Off on the wing for Powers, to step back three, it's good! Wow! Dante Powers with three buckets here in the last couple of minutes, he's got seven. And it's 60 to 50 and a 10 point lead for the Bearcat with three and a half to play. May is going to come back in at the next whistle. They feed the post for Gibson. Gibson against Ray, muscles it up off the glass, no good. Flag clears the rebound. That's number 11. Tom, what great defense by Jaden Ray right there. Even though he was outsized, yep. he refused to be budged off of that spot. Here's Ray, crossover dribble. Back outside for Powers. Powers, he may be feeling it right now. Got eight to shoot, looking for a screen. Powers, got to the baseline, spins away. Had the ball knocked out of his hands, comes out to Ray. He'll shoot at the buzzer. Go! Oh, oh my, Jade Ray! Wow! Free at the buzzer after the ball was poked free from Powers. 63 to 50, biggest lead of the night for the Bearcats with two minutes and 35 seconds to go. Here's Taj Small working on Powers. Left it for Gibson, had his pocket picked by Powers. And away comes Grant. Grant on the wing for Lampley's three, good! Lampley in double figures with 11. And it's now 66 to 50. Tom, I think the Bearcats understand the importance of getting this win tonight. And how well, the Bearcats had the answer for that run. Here's Taj Small at the free throw line. Cut off by May. Gave it up to Gibson. Down in the corner, McDavid to Gibson. They have six to shoot. And it's going to be a foul on the floor. It's going to be a Powers, I think so. It'll be his third. 16 foul now on the Bearcats. 
What was interesting about that last timeout is that Billy Gillespie wasn't in it. He walked away. He let his he let his assistants have it. He was walking on the back side of the huddle. I couldn't believe what I saw, and he never went back in. He was not pleased with what his team was saying. He said, if I can't say anything nice, I better not say anything at all. And so he walked away. Minute and a half to go now. Bearcats in full command by 16 here. Jaden Ray will milk the clock. Shot clock is at seven. Ray still got it. Back out to flag with two. Long range three. Good! Oh my goodness! That was from beyond the hash mark. Flag with 18. Oh, oh baby. Tommy, did you see him size the defender up and just kind of step back just like it was no big deal? Yeah. Hit three. Wow. He's impressive. One minute to play here, 69 to 50. Bearcats are going to go at 13 and 5 to finish the conference season. Baseline drive by McDavid into the arms of Daniel. Fall to the floor. Was he pushed or did he fall out of bounds? He fell out of bounds. Another turnover for the Texans. Number 13 for Tarleton. 49 seconds to play now. The Bearcats can milk this. They've got 20 to shoot. And that will leave just 19 seconds left in the game. Big second half for Savion Flag. 11 of his 18 points. Jaden May with six of his 10. Shot clock at four, at three. Steele throwing it ahead for McDavid. Blocked by May from behind. My goodness. Wow. Here is Powers. Through a double team with a dribble. Game clock is at seven. Gave it up to Ray. Ray will give it to Lampley, and Lampley will shoot one at the buzzer.